Hello, hello, hello! It's Rizli. We're playing Super Otter Pets. Let's give it a go! Alrighty, this is the second attempt at the New Weekly. And as I said before, I said it in writing, I sure you can read. I assure you, you probably can. It is a relatively swole weekly. I will say it is buff, it is luxurious, things are going rockin'. I recently heard that the porcupine, which is previously known as, okay, a uh, little hot note here, garbage sauce all the way across the sky. So far, I've been having decent luck with rolling off of garbage into things that are less garbageful. Which, I mean, given I think maybe like half of the things are kind of garbage, no, I think the minority are. For some reason, my first rolls on turn one have always just been kind of stanky. Green fungi, glamorous machines, hilly invaders, green invaders, invaders in anybody. Classic childhood voice that I think was used in multiple characters. Still one of my favorites to this day. But what I've heard exactly is, you know how like everyone who has a hurt trigger is like infinitely better than they were before? Because now they're all guaranteed to trigger at least once because they trigger on death. So things like the Triceratops, you know. He's gonna give plus nine, plus nine on level three at least once, which just doing that once is decent enough, you know? Obviously he has to get to level three, but at that point he'll probably go more than once. The real star here is the Porcupine, who I never take. I literally have never taken him. I have taken him, but I refuse to ever since I did it a few times because he literally seems to die every single time. He either dies, right, so he didn't get to use his hurt trigger in the past, or he kills the guy, so there was no point in his hurt trigger. His hurt trigger was, like, literally the least triggered thing I've ever seen in the entire Super Auto Pets, but now that he is able to automatically hit at least once, he kind of has become basically like a badger, you know? Like, if you level him to, like, level 2, 6 damage, a lot of badgers, you know, in the early game are only gonna do maybe about that much damage anyhow. Plus, he gets to do it if he gets hit, and he doesn't even hit his own team like the Badger does. So I kind of feel like he's just a cooler Badger, and I respect the Badger. I'll buy a Badger. I will place a Badger upon the team. I respect them that gosh darn hard. I wasn't going to do the whole Iguana thing. I was thinking the Iguana thing, you know, reptilians. I'm more of like a little rodent person myself. When I was young, I wanted mice. I wanted rabbits, all that kind of jazz. However, if they're going to give me a level about it... I'm not specifically doing it in the name of science, and by science I mostly mean in the name of getting a bison with like a level 3 guy. Oh, they're kind of making it seem like I'm supposed to be doing that though. A wasp, but do we have the stats to do things with that? We have apples, we have giraffes. Technically speaking, a wasp could do things. Do I like it more than an ox? That's the real question. Probably... I'm gonna save the fish for next turn, and I kind of wish I'd bought that apple for a wasp instead, but happy birthday to the fish, it's a meat bone. A tasty, tasty meat bone. I don't know if you're like a piranha, maybe you've got a cousin who's a piranha and you've learned the way of having teeth. I can't see the teeth, but there are those monsters, you know, the scariest monsters are the ones that are hiding behind innocence. Behind that sweet, stupid looking fish face, he actually has like 16 jaws or something. They attract out like a tongue. Okay, here is the time of dreams. I would say give me a bison, except I don't actually want a bison because I can't do anything with it, so please don't, and you didn't. Yay for me. A giraffe. Yes. So this is the thing. A thing is going down. The iguana is stupid because there are no early game summons, which means you are not literally- you were, there's not even any bees. You were physically impossible that you were going to do anything for me. There's the porcupine we were all talking about, and in fact, I'm gonna run it. We, I'm so confident, in fact, that what I was saying a second ago is in fact the truth. This isn't gonna do anything for me, but hey, you know, two wasps. Who's gonna shake your head at two wasps? Probably should have kept that apple as well. Our giraffe is in fact not doing enough. I have like three different guys I want to stat up, which is crazy because this early in the game, I feel like I constantly just have like nothing. I have like one guy who's like a maybe and a bunch of dudes who I'm like, you guys can leave whenever you want. This isn't like a, you know, I may be the host of this party, but I'm not like at a standstill. You know, I'm not going to shake my head if you guys leave early. In fact, maybe I would support it if you guys left early, I will admit. I only had enough snacks and food prepared for like five people. So when each of those five people ended up inviting like seven additional people, it was a little bit, you know, it's just a little bit more than I had previously expected, but... I'm not gonna bother you about it, I say, clenching my fist as blood trickles down my entire arm. There is the murder, see? It hit somebody, and then it killed them. I know it's a crazy concept. The porcupine, who would have thought? The porcupine himself 
I would like both of you guys to get stats, so I guess we're splitting it up. And you know what? You both can have stats, because we have two giraffes and almost a level. And almost a level part two. We have like three almost levels and one guy with a level. This is going to help the link so much when any of them actually get to level two, though. Stop shooting my guys. I guess I shot yours. We're even. How about everyone gets pounced by this hot porcupine? Our wasp is in fact doing damage. That's the tricky thing about the wasp, though. Even if you're able to get him to get damage, the thing is that we don't have any lollipops, which means if he wants health to make that damage, like, last more than one hit, he's gonna have to find it himself, because I have nothing to offer you. Simply nothing to offer you. We'll do bananas today, but I do like the pear. For the wasp, for the porcupine. Honestly, the wasp is like, he's made to be a glass cannon. Excluding the existence of lollipops, he's made to be a glass cannon. So maybe I should just respect how he is as a person. He's got one stinger. I think that's bees and not wasps, but he's like a bee in disguise or something. He's got one stinger and one shot. He doesn't need the health. All he needs is me to believe in him. We're gonna stack because monkey is better than everything in the universe. Pills are in the pack, so I could kill my lynx to get more of them. I'm not gonna do that, but gosh darn silly sue, I could. We're gonna do this specifically because obviously I should. Look at all the things I have now. Oh, wait a second. I haven't tested this. Hurt triggers in battle trigger on death now. Does that mean that not only does every faint trigger do something in the shop when they're pilled, but you can also pill anything with a faint trigger, a hurt trigger to do that too? Like, is a triceratops, is a triceratops now like a buy? This is basically like a meat bone if you had a pill and you level it and it does even more meat bone-esque actions. Interesting concept. Here's the thing here. Scaling. Like, you've got the scaling of dreams. That's great. I could get the cat in here. It only works two times per turn, which is not amazing, but there is meat bones, oranges, and pears. It's a decent food statage, but who am I gonna sell to make that work? You're too good for me. He's too good to me. He's gonna be, like, maxed out on an attack in just a second. I was hoping this guy would- you know what? Is it gonna be the lynx? I would like to pill you more than that, though. Save me for one turn. We're not going to level the wasp. He's going to get there by himself anyway. Let's do it. This is a horrible decision to make. This is not going to gain us much in the long run. However, in the short run, in the immediacy that is next uh, next turn, where we will in fact be alive because I have the health to prove it. A rooster? I haven't seen one of you in literal ages. Yeah, go ahead and smack me. I am literally the sniper antichrist. The Antichrist of all snipers. My monkey was better than your monkey. How about get a cooler monkey? I realized my monkey was only cool because of the Triceratops, but friendship matters. Him getting cool because he has, like, super friendship, that's not anything worse than, like, other options. I could, and I probably should, in fact, replace my, uh, this guy. He's got decent stats, but I don't know if he actually, like, made it. I don't know if he's actually king of the, like, kill or anything. If I was really going for him, I think he could be a run definer. I truly believe the porcupine. He is a tier four that actually is tier four quality, which is crazy because how many of those are? Like half of them or something? Maybe a quarter? Wow. Um, you're not supposed to actually be able to do anything with your level two iguana. I will say, kind of audacious of you. Somebody could get saucy. And somebody will get saucy. I think the rooster is still amazing. We're not doing that today, even though you could say to me, you could look at me and you say, um, dearest. You silly soul. Of course you should be running the rooster today. It's always amazing. If you want to live, it has to become now. How about I just give like a bunch more health to people, hmm? Have you ever considered healing is cooler than like having other things? Hmm? More pets? What if I just want to stick with these guys? Two scalers with zero stats at the back of the party probably isn't the best thing we could be doing. But boom, look, uh, an emergency monkey. <laughs> you can't say no to the emergency monkey. A monkey coming out of a monkey? That's hilarious. I could kill this monkey to summon a 4-4 monkey, which would give me more attack and less health. It's a hilarious concept. And you know what? You can be the one to level. If I'm gonna get rid of this porcupine, it's gonna be now because of this cow situation. In fact, I think it's worth, especially just because I, I love the orca. I think the orca is just flat out worth this whole selling situation. Another monkey. I'll save the monkey for tomorrow. I'm not going to pill anyone, so we're not going to run this monkey on monkey strat. I would love it if you actually had the attack of dreams. Here's the situation now. 
Who is the Triceratops giving these hot stats to? Because I've been putting a lot of my eggs into this one basket, which has no lemon. A lemonless basket? You could say that's, like, not a great thing to support, but yeah, here I am doing that. But nobody behind me has any stats, so getting just a tiny bit more, is that gonna help me? You stupid porcupine! <laughs> There it is live in action, the porcupine being um, way stronger than ever before, and it was backed up by a snake. That was double trouble. That was double snipers all the way across the sky. Cockroach. It's gonna be a 2-4. Wow. This thing always have this stat. Did this not used to be like a 1-3 or something? This actually seems like it's always been like that, but that means that the cockroach on turn 1 is a 2-4. That's like the best stat a guy on turn 1 of, of anybody. You won't trick me again, Iguana. I know that you're not actually anything. So much so that I'm actually going to permanently boost somebody else. We can be some broken backers, hooting pieces, sulking fussbots. Let us be some sulking fussbots. We're fussy, but we're also sulking about it. We're sulking because we're not as fussy as we could be. Our mother said you will be the fussiest one day, and we said, oh gosh, John, no, I shall not give me more food. And she said, that's my gal, but then here I am today, not being nearly perturbed by things as much as I thought I was going to be. More fish. Yes. I can't help but notice that we didn't win last round. I know I ran three squatted, but it was a big fish and a cockroach. Did they also have cockroaches? It was the only way. Ooh, god, I wish I had a mosquito. Ooh. Don't you just hate it when you totally could've won, but their placement was just specifically perfect? Sounds like, like you're fighting a real person in the game. Oh, it's at the start of turn. So the very first turn, they're not this strong. Okay. That's why I was not nearly as strong as I had hoped to be. Not nearly as strong as my dreams. I like the scaling. But this man is just a good man. He's a good man, Savannah. He's a good man. He could in fact do summons or I could just buy a hedgehog. I appreciate a hedgehog. Little musical notes came out of his body when I bought him. Was that just a him thing or is everyone doing that now? Are we all secretly music boxes, or just like the hedgehog knows how to sing? He's a country dance star. Too many stats? Doesn't matter. I don't have a B, so the whole guy in the back who kills himself and other people is less appealing of a concept. For lack of a B, we level tomorrow. I don't want to keep you. I'm going to do this, despite the fact that I would, I would say it's not super advisable. But hey, more hedgehogs, so I guess we came out like neutral. That is one interesting thing. When I do this thing, right, where I have like one and a half and one and a half, I never wanted to combine them in the past because I was like, oh, but if we can level both of them and they combine, this three whole like level triggers, you know? A two, a two, and then to combine for a three. Now that that doesn't do anything, it makes me feel so much less bad about just combining these, you know? I can just be like, yep, it's time. It's turn five. This is when we do this. Which is great, because I love not feeling guilty for things that feel like they shouldn't be felt guilty for. A level again? Still no bison. I was kind of thinking, I hope it's not a bison because we can't use it, but also part of me was like, what if though? What if? I would sell my fish, I wouldn't have enough gold. I was gonna say I'd sell my fish for a sheep because that would be a good trade. No matter how many stats I have, I dare say a sheep is one of the best um, tier threes, I guess, for early game. Three whole units summoning. Early summoning is really the jam. Spicy, I like the amount of death that happened there. I like the amount of death that happened there. It was a good amount of death on the enemy team. If I was the Grim Reaper, I would say I had a job well done today. Honestly, could have been a little less probably. I could have worked a little bit less, but still a pretty good amount of death there. I considered the meat. I considered the meat on the deer. If they're offering me additional sheep. Do I want that? Not really. I don't even want the hedgehog though, so I guess we're just gonna- You know what? You're gone. Technically the hedgehog is like better than you by default of everything, like literally everything about it I suppose. However, we've got more of these guys today, so we could pill somebody. We could pill the deer and get a bus. What a genius concept. What a genius idea, which would reap us approximately nothing. Wizards in a study, cowboys in an abandoned fantasy forest. Spicy? Spicy. You didn't even see my full potential. I had an entire other... Not a woodpecker. A ho hoopo bird. Interesting name there. You leveling is cool. You existing? Decent stats? Not today. Tomorrow, maybe. Maybe tomorrow. Come back tomorrow and we'll talk about it. So if I pill... None of you. Okay, yeah. None of you guys are hurt triggers that would actually be helpful for us. 
I would love it if we had some stat gainage. I admit the fact that I've had like half of the shop frozen the majority of the time up until this point probably isn't helping the whole concept of stat gainage. That's a stat. That's a lot of stat. Where did the stat come from? Enemy team, if you were to describe the statage, would you be able to? What did you eat? A bird? Not even that good. Man, a bee would have been so gosh darn tasty right now. A bee would have been so tasty. Yes? Everyone have some stats? Okay, a crocodile is something. It's very tragic to have to lose the cow. It's really late for a bison. It's very late for a bison. I assume you just do like six or something to the two guys when you die. Where are you? Where do you exist? You're a tier three. Six to the first and last. Plus two. Six, you're gonna do eight to the first and last guy. That's not too bad. That's like two, two acrocodias at level three when we get you there. Am I gonna give somebody up? I'm gonna save you and buy this because I can't think, I don't think I can get him today anyhow. Well, I could have, but I'm not choosing to. If tomorrow, if tomorrow in the shop, we are able to get this bird to level three, despite the fact that it's turn nine, I will no longer desire this fish. I was considering accepting that onto my team. That is a large porcupine. It didn't even matter. And sometimes it doesn't even matter. It's crazy like that. Honestly, it kind of makes me feel like nothing really matters at all. Because why are we even trying if, if everyone's just going to die anyway? Oh, but the scaling. But the scaling, though. But I'm going to sell you for the scales. I am going to sell you for the scales. Okay, we've got a whole team. We've got a whole team swap going down. More lemons. Nobody is doing anything good here. But, like, the deer has a chili and then he turns into a chili and both those chilies are kind of doing, like, more damage. So, in terms of stats, we are horrendous. That team looks like it's got a lot of things happening. Things which I would I would expect to be actually good for their squad. No, that was a lot closer than one would expect. One would expect that to have gone a lot worse. Yes? Yes? We roll for a level. I would have loved anything to level, please. Nothing. What? You know, Bison? Get out of my face. Well? Yes, get out of my face. Well? No, yes, get out of my face. Just just today, this is just this is better by right now. It's just always been better. And there's my level three I needed this whole time. Um, Bison, I know I told you to get in my face. How about get back in my face so I can spit on you and say, just kidding, even if I have a level three, you're still too late in action, you know? It's not always fashionable to be crazy late. Sometimes it's just extremely rude to who you're supposed to be friends with. Hmm? Spicy boy, I was wishing that I could have killed you. A level three bison on turn eleven, I'm jelly. Definitely, certainly jelly. Mmm, statage. Well, I've got an achievement now for doing that, so that's cool. The deer could go. For the ostrich. The ostrich, the ostrich. But why? But why? Are you good? 8-8? Eight, eight? That's pretty good. You've got the statage. You're the only guy getting anything from the penguin, which makes it seem like you have to exist. Otherwise, why did I buy this penguin? Yes? You know... You're great, and you're basically a level 2 by virtue of the fact that you, like, have level 2 chili. You know, you've got two chilies, which kind of feels like you're a level 2, but you're not quite a level 2 in actuality. I will keep the scalers here. I do, in fact, enjoy a monkey more than I like a penguin, even if the penguin is half halfway there, you know? Only one guy here actually I care about, which is mostly you. Ouch, this is gonna suck. That's what I thought. I honestly didn't think you were gonna survive a single hit, so you did better than I expected. Ooh, chili bird. I like me a spicy bird, but normally not when it's still alive, you know? If you get what I'm putting down. Sweet. Tasty snackage. The tastiest snackage in the universe. Is any of this great? A steak would be okay. Sadly, we have no money. Sadly, I am a broke and sad child. A 1-1, one, one. And, and then you look at me and you say, girly, girly pop, um, an ostrich over here? She, in fact, needs enabling. You've, you've completely wasted your child's potential. And I would say, I don't need my child to have potential. I had potential once when I was young. I'm not going to force my ideals onto my child just because I wish that I had done better when I was a child. And you're like, whoa, that's probably the most mature thing I've heard you ever say. And they're like, thank you, thank you. I try. Okay, my team, um, we had like five health. 
a second ago, and now we don't. And I think it's because we we just suck. I, I gained no distinct, like, uh, image. I had no image of what we needed to do. I was switching here and there. I'm going against teams which exclusively have whales for some reason. I don't know if whales are just a big thing nowadays. Your snake needs to get out of my face. Beautiful. No! It was fine. It's, what uh, Do I expect to- I forgot to unfreeze you. Well, that's whatever. Honestly, it's fine. I kind of like this anyhow. Everyone gets lemons. Happy birthday to the world. Yes? No. No. Mosquito, you think that you're cool? You think that you can just join this whole party of, like, cooler people? Hmm? But yes. I think I kept this bird in the middle here. This little, uh, wish.com woodpecker. I think I kept it too long. It's not doing much. In fact, I would probably switch it out now for something better. Thank you for killing him in one hit. Thank you for dying in one hit. Thank you for dying in one and a cheaty snipey hit. Five wins. Is this better than last turn? Maybe. I immediately forgot what happened last turn. I could sell you for an orca. In fact, in fact, I think I might. I think I simply might. In fact, I will right now, actually. Guess this, followed by oranges, followed by rolling for more tears. We'll buy the Triceratops tomorrow. I was hoping for more than this, I will admit it. I will admit this is not what I wanted. Three of the guys on my team, stinky hot biscuits. They're hot in their biscuits, but gosh, don't they stink? Something rank went down with these biscuits. You have too much health to exist. It's just impossible that you do exist. If that guy, even if we had killed him, he would have bombarded the rest of the squad. Not a great look. I will admit, not a great look. Five wins, halfway there. That's like, what, a C? No, a 50 is a D. I could have guessed the answers and done better than that. Jang, jang. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.